dare you to pop in my mentions Hulk. Brown skin poppin' sugar Kimball, Mr. Cover Girl I'm waving bitches second I robot they sweatin' thumb These niggas spendin' hella pensions if they're pussy pine Coppin' diamonds if I Hey beauties! Welcome back to my channel, bitch! Um, <clears throat> so, I'm back with another video. I'm back with orange hair, kinda sorta orange. Now, let me just say this, okay? Kat Von D's foundation, you need to go get it because, honey, you see all of this? I use Kat Von D's foundation on my chest area because I break out a lot on my chest. Not a lot, but I have a few marks on my chest, but I just used Kat Von D's foundation. I just covered up my whole chest piece, pretty much. And I also get a few acne, like, down my arms. I also covered up my arms with Kat Von D's um, foundation so I just want to let you guys know if you suffer from like acne scars you know and you're very like un, you know insecure about them because I'm very insecure about my little um back acne and arm acne and chest acne it's not bad but it's still like you can see it if you are insecure about that and you're looking for something to help cover it up Kat Von D foundation does a great job I'm telling you once you get your correct skin tone it does an amazing job and it's not too it doesn't feel heavy doesn't even feel like i have on makeup and also it's waterproof so you can go swimming with this shit on your body you can go, if you got bumps all over your motherfucking body you can cover it with kat von d's foundation jump in the pool come out and nothing is coming off of you As you guys know i collaborated with evahair.com i did the orange hair on my channel that video did very well a lot of you guys our new subscribers because of that video thank you for watching that video i put a lot of hard work into that video and i was not thanked for doing that video um basically they are racist they did not feature me on the instagram page they don't ins they don't feature any women of color on their instagram page so it's not just me it's all women of color so i'm guessing they don't like women of color on their instagram page but they want us to work with them and promote them for free Gotcha, sis. Heard you, sis. I heard you. I know a lot of you guys were asking for a, you know, um, a, a bob. Well, not asking. I told you guys. I asked, do you want me to cut this into a bob? A lot of you guys wanted to see it in a bob so badly. Unfortunately, because of that situation, I don't feel comfortable promoting their hair. I don't feel comfortable putting their hair on my channel again. You know, I just don't feel comfortable. You know, I feel like I'm gonna do it and they're not gonna promote me. And it's not even just about me doing it so they can promote me. It's me doing it so that I can help you guys and so that I can get recognition for my work. And also, you know, I don't understand how they didn't wanna... My video is probably on 120 something K right now. That's good business for you. Won't you be proud of that? Like, wow. This girl got so many views on my wig, you know, my company's wig. Like, let me put her on my Instagram and say, shout out to Miss Chrissy, or however you shout out people to Miss Chrissy J for, you know, having all these views and, and us getting us sales. Thank you so much. You did an amazing job. Thank you. I would at least appreciate that. I got a thank you through an email, but I didn't get a thank you in public. So how do you think that makes me feel? How do you think that makes me feel? You know, I told you guys I was going to come back with a bob for you. I found a replica for that hair. Now, this hair is not as orange as it is in the video. It's giving me an orange, auburn, reddish, leafy type of color. I feel like this orange is perfect for women of color, especially deeper skin tones. This hair looks good on me. It will look good on a girl that is darker than me. It will look, girl, look good on a girl that's lighter than me. I feel like this color is very, it's good for all skin tones. This is the wig, how it comes out of the packet, just like this. It's an asymmetric bob, so it's longer on this side, short in the back, a little length on this side. It's a really, really cute wig. Now, like I said before, this hair is not an exact, you know, look of Eva hair, which I hate fucking saying. Um, you know, that was really, really orange. This is kind of like an auburn, you know, like a, this would be a burnt orange. That was an orange. I would say this is like a burnt orange. I still think you can achieve this Tiana Taylor look with this hair color. I still think you can. And we're going to do that today. A wig, a full wig. This is not a lace wig. Uh, there is no lace on this wig. There's no lace that comes on this wig. Now, this wig has two clips in the front and they're right here. So, when you put the wig to the side, one clip goes here in the middle of your head 
and one clip goes here so that that is really snug. Uh, it also has one clip, let me show you. It also has one clip in the back. Okay, so the wig is on my head. Really, really pretty. Now, as I said, there is no lace. This is not a lace wig. Now, you know me. I can't just have this on my head and go. I have to lay her down, lay the front down. And I'm gonna show you how to do that without lace. So let me just zoom in for you guys. Oh, and before I zoom in, today I'm going to be using the Gorilla Snot Gel. This gel is another got to be glued gel. It definitely holds, you know, your baby hairs on top of the lace. It is good for slaying the front of your wigs. I think I got the wrong one. I'm new to this. Um, I went into the store. I didn't read. I just picked it up. I didn't realize that a lot of them on the back shows you the hold meter on the back of the gel. It has like a little, um, let me see if I can zoom in and show you. I don't know if you guys can see that. Do you see the meter that it has? So it tells you how well it holds. So this is on number nine. You see how it has number nine, number 10. This is on number nine. Okay, so I didn't know and I looked and I'm like, oh, it's on number nine. So that means it's not gonna hold really, really well. Now go out, if you do purchase this, definitely go out and get the one that says hold meter number 10. Make sure you look on the back and you say hold meter, hold meter, hold meter number 10. I believe the purple, there's a lot of different color bottles. I think the yellow and purple bottle is a number 10. Yes, the purple and yellow bottle is a number 10. Definitely buy that. I don't recommend. Okay, so now to lay my edges, this is what I'm going to do. Simply take some hairs from the side of the wig with my nail, just a little bit of hairs, not too much. And I'm gonna put the rest behind my ears like I always do. Can't you see? Sometimes your words just hypnotize me. And I just love your fleshy ways. I guess that's why they're broken, you're so big. Can't you see? Sometimes your words just hypnotize me. And I just love your fleshy ways. I guess that's why they're broken, you're so big. so long okay the parting of the wig is has a small parting right here this parting could definitely be plucked it's kind of tight but it's still natural looking now I would suggest plucking the parting I'm not gonna pluck the parting today but you guys can pluck the parting it's really tight but I feel like it still has a natural look to it this is how she's looking in the back really short um, the clip is actually right here. Let me see. 
Yeah, the clip is right here. Now, if my hair looks puffy, it's because my hair is not laid underneath, so it may look a little puffy and wiggy, but this is how she looks from the back. Now, she is $19.38 on wigtypes.com. Wig type shipping is now about $10. She's probably gonna come up to around $30, maybe $25. Little plucking. The length is cute. Little cutting though, it's a little bit too long. Lay the front like how I lay it, um, and you're good to go. I think she's really, really cute. She's really cute for the summertime. Something different, something new. New color, new cut, new style. You know, it's fun. It's not that expensive. You can wear her, you can go out for a day or two if you just wanna switch up your look. It's just one of those fun wigs that don't look like fun wigs, quote unquote, costumey wigs, you know? It's one of those fun wigs that actually looks natural. I suggest it. She is Miss Chrissy J approved. I am done with this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. My battery is dying, so I'm talking really, really fast. I love you so much. Please don't forget to follow me at Snapchat Miss Chrissy J, Twitter Miss Chrissy J, and Instagram Miss Chrissy J. Send me some DMs, send me some comments. Let me know what you think about this hair below. If you will be purchasing, Love you guys so much. I'll see you in my next video. But until then, keep slaying. I'm into making niggas beg for the coochie. Eat my ass good, buy me gifts out of Gucci. Let the bitch smoke, buy me 50 cent Lucy's. And I ain't never talking to a nigga in a hoopie unless he looking real sexy.